and gentlemen. Hello, I'm Amanda Stretton and welcome to the Design Museum here in the heart of London. We're about to witness the launch of Panasonic Jaguar Racing Season 5. Let's bring you the star of the show, the Jaguar I-Type 3. For us, it's the next step. It's that, you know, as I said, we've been very pragmatic about our journey, and the next step is moving from a regular points team to a regular podium team, and that's what we need to be get, getting towards, that we are a team which is able to regularly fight and put ourselves in a position to be on the podium, and that's our, our very clear goal. So 25% more powerful. Uh, we've been able to do that uh, by improving also the efficiency, um, making sure we don't gain any extra weight. So obviously, we have to try and be more powerful, more efficient, but not any put, put any more weight into the powertrain. This is the first generation where we've developed it entirely in-house. So that includes the uh, motor generator unit, the inverter, you know, the, the motor control unit, uh, the control systems, uh, the carbon trans, uh, transmission casing, the differential. Uh, everything is um, uh, 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 done in-house. That gives us the ability to package how we want it to be, uh, gives us the performance that we can get with the weight, the centre of gravity, the sort of smaller details that maybe is not talked about so much in the formula. But at the end of the day, we're racing a racing car and we have to optimise every single aspect of it. The I-Type 3 looks absolutely amazing. It's such a progressive, avant-garde piece of design. I think it really helps visually telegraph the high-tech uh, nature of electric street racing. I just want to see Jaguar at the top. Um, nice. I know how hard the, the team have worked behind the scenes. Obviously, we've had two years in the championship. The first year was, was, was tough for us coming in as a, as a brand new team. We made huge steps forward, but I really want to see, see Jaguar at the, at the front, whether it's Nelson and I or both of us. It came out something about Formula One, the, the future of the Formula One car, and I, I, I thought it looked so much like a Formula E car. It seemed like the, the cop at the design over here, the future of Formula One. So definitely it shows uh, that we are being now uh, the, the series to look at, you know, and uh, for sure, I think since season one, you can't even compare it, you know, people, even laughed at us when we did the first season, you know, and, and now it's the place to be where all the drivers want to be, all the manufacturers want to be. I think the team developed very, very, very good. Uh, when we started thinking about this adventure, taking part at Formula E, we developed a very precise and detailed three-year plan. First year, our aim was to take part, to gain some experiences, to learn the processes, to, to build relationships. Second season, the, the target was to score regularly in the points, which we did, with the exception of two races. And of course, next season with this fantastic new car, our, our uh, goal is, as Nelson pointed out, uh, to be a uh, regular fighting for a podium. We look forward to seeing you all in Riyadh in December. Thank you very much, everyone. It's been an absolute pleasure. Good luck.